think we're live. Okay, it says we're live. What is going on, guys? Get you one two three zero here with more Grand Theft Auto Five. And today, how about we click into the game here? We're playing more Grand Theft Auto Five. As I said, we are looking at something amazing. This vehicle right here is the Koenigsegg Jesko. So this is clearly a supercar, and obviously, normally you're going to be using it for uh, street use, like we are here. Today, what we're going to be doing is lifting this thing up four, maybe five feet, putting some huge tires on it, and basically taking it off-road through the swamps, up the mountains, and all that good stuff. So uh, if you guys do enjoy this video, remember to drop a like down below, and uh, we're going to hop right into it. So for those of you who are interested in cars and care about the specs, I wrote down a few of the specs of this car in real life, because this is a real car, you know? This thing exists in real life. It is manufactured and sold. So, uh, let me see, as soon as I find a good spot to pull over here, just so we don't crash it, let me read you guys just a couple things about this car, and then we're gonna hop right into it. Let's, uh, start by pulling off up here. Okay, don't honk at me. So, uh, as I said, this is the Conaseg Jesco. Oh my gosh, did we park in a bad spot? I guess we did. Anyways, this is a $3 million car. It has two, or no, it can go a top speed of 278 miles per hour. Other sources said 300 miles per hour, even 330 miles per hour, but I took the lower, more conservative estimate because I feel like a lot of people like to inflate those kinds of numbers. Uh, it is a 5.0 liter twin turbocharged V8 engine capable of creating 1,281 horsepower, and it uses a nine-speed multi-clutch transmission, and it is capable of going zero to 60 in 1.9 seconds. So this thing has a lot of beef behind it. You know, it is definitely no slouch on the road. But as I said, today we're not really testing it on the road so much. We're uh, we're gonna give it a big old lift. Watch out, watch out, I'm coming through. And uh, we're gonna see exactly what it's capable of. So guys, how's it going? We got Benjamin, Timothy, Darth, Isaac, Kendall, Garrett, Ben, FBI, Leafy, Aiden, Ruff, uh, West Virginia, Ryan, Chance, L-Series, Fortnite OG. Guys, thank you all for clicking on so far. Uh, let's get into some of the good stuff here. Can we kind of get down this in a not-so-violent fashion? So we're going to start just by lifting it up a little bit. And uh, once we get it lifted, then we'll start playing with the tires and hop into it all. So we're going to be using this mod here called V-Stancer. And we go to the suspension menu here. And we can start playing with the front height. Now the thing about raising these cars that I've learned is that you can't just lift it straight up like right away, real fast like this. And you'll see why here. If you do it all at once, we're probably gonna start bugging out, as you can see here. So the key to doing this without it bugging out is to do it small increments at a time and also drive it while you are uh, lifting it. So let's put it in some motion here. And as we're driving it, I'm going to be lifting the front height, go to the rear height, go back up to the front height. Already you can see it is uh, a nice bit higher, but it's not the four feet that we were talking about, so we got to keep this vehicle in motion, otherwise the wheels will start bugging out. So now that front end, a nice bit taller, looking good. Let's take up the rear height a little bit. You can see here, we are officially at the height where it wants to start doing a little bit of that. Uh, no surprise. We can combat that by making the wheelbase a little bit more wide, and that'll uh, give a lot more stability here. Uh, we're almost already at the height that we want it at. What did I find was good before? A height of about right roughly where we are right now. I don't want to push it too far and take it too much higher. Uh, out of fears that we might start bugging it a little bit. Um, let me see, anything good in chat? Guys, I'm doing well, thanks for asking. I hope you guys are all doing well, staying healthy out there, washing your hands, all that good stuff. Yo, Alex, what's up? Ben, thanks for dropping the like. Rough country, how's life? Life is good, dude. Life is good. Uh, let's see, so let's make the track width a little bit wider. As you can see, when we were doing those donuts, we were kind of rolling over a little bit. So if you look at these front wheels, Oh my gosh, we can take them super wide, but that's a little bit ridiculous, isn't it? That's just a little bit crazy, so let's not do quite that. Uh, Dogman2365 is now following me on Twitch. Dog, thanks for uh, following over on Twitch. I do appreciate it, my dude. 
So let's make uh, this rear track width match. 1.16 it looks like in the front. And now it's going to be a little bit less prone to rolling. So, all right, before we put on some bigger tires, let's just take it out for a quick spin like this, as ridiculous as it is. Looks a little bit weird, but already it's a lot more functional as far as its ground clearance, bottoming out, scraping, all that stuff. We already have that much more functionality. Jet3 of us, thanks for following me over on Twitch, dude. My Twitch name's the same as it is here on YouTube, uh, Gitchy1230. I did mean to turn down that notification volume, but I kind of forgot, so I'm sorry if it's uh, a little loud on your ears. Yo, B, what's up, man? I see you in chat there. This might be a car, but we're basically going to turn it into a super mud truck car. Mud car. Hot Todd, 420, thanks for uh, dropping that follow, man. Gucci boys, thanks for uh, dropping a like here on the stream. Alright, so, looks like so far, this thing's perfectly capable. Oh my gosh, I did not expect this many followers to be popping in over on my Twitch. Ghost TTVYT, thanks for following on Twitch. Uh, yesterday, guys, I did a Twitch stream after the YouTube stream. Today, unfortunately, I'm not going to have time to do that. But uh, tomorrow, I would like to do another Twitch stream. So uh, over on Twitch, it's a fun, relaxed atmosphere. We play different games. We play some Rocket League. We play pretty much whatever I feel like playing play some music while we do it. It's a, a nice, fun, relaxed atmosphere. Alright, so, let me see. Let's test this on a quick hill climb here. Yo, real quick, we got... Loza. With the 199 Super Chat. Chat. Thank you, Loza. I appreciate it, my man. Always dropping those Super Chats and bits and whatnot. I appreciate the heck out of it. Welcome to the stream, dude. Hope you're having a fine day. Starting early today, for real? Yeah, we are starting early today. I'm, I'm trying to stay on top of everything. Stay organized, get stuff done, right? Okay, so let's uh, take it back down here. Now we're going to start playing with the tires a little bit. Clearly, this extra ground clearance is working exactly how we wanted it to. Look at that, no scraping. Suddenly this thing is super capable for off-road. So let's go back into this mod menu. So unfortunately, the way this mod works, it doesn't allow us to make tires uh, bigger the, like, when they're stock tires. Hold on, wait, time out. I'm sorry, guys. We got a $25 super chat. Yo, Timothy Wolf. <laughs> Thank you, my man. Thank you. You are awesome. I appreciate the heck out of that, dude. I don't even know what to say. $25 super chat. You just, like, bought my lunch for the next few days. I appreciate the heck out of that. <laughs> Tim, you are awesome, man. Thank you, thank you. Whew. Okay, um, what was I just saying? So, <laughs> we want to make these tires bigger, but unfortunately you can't make stock tires bigger. So what we got to do here is go into our other mod menu and do some mods to this vehicle. Where's the F3 key? Brody, thanks for dropping the follow. Lots of distractions here, guys. I am trying to keep this moving, but... Between all the follows and the super chats, whew, you guys are killing me over here. Killing me softly. Killing me in a, a good way, you could say. Um, all right, real quick. Hold on, we got another super chat here. Loza, I got some cheeseburger sliders. Dude, thank you. Thank you. For another two bucks, man. Enjoy those sliders. I'm not going to lie. I could definitely go for a slider right now. Uh, okay, okay, so what are we doing here? Vehicle options. Vehicle mod menu. Change wheel type. Right now you can see we have high-end wheels highlighted. We're going to take that over to uh, off-road. There we go. And uh, let's do some uh, up here to wheels. So say goodbye to the nice slick rims. For doing this we have to use one of the 20 options for the off-road tires. Which, okay, isn't so bad. To be honest, it's probably going to look a bit more natural. Um, so are you faring with not being able to leave your house? I heard they issued a mandatory stay-at-home order. They did. Uh, so far, it's mostly the same for me. I'm not somebody who goes out a whole bunch, so so far, uh, for me, it's it's mostly the same. Just a little less, like, no going out for chicken wings. You know, that kind of sucks, but for the most part, it works out just fine. Um, Alright, so we got our off-road tires on here. 
And believe it or not, guys, I don't know if you knew, knew this, but I made a video on this a few years back. I made a video titled uh, something along the lines of, do off-road tires really help for off-roading? Do they actually give you more traction? So I ran a bunch of trials where I put a supercar or a sports car with regular tires against the same sports car with um, off-road tires. And it turns out the off-road tires did improve the times of the hill climb. Off-road tires do offer more traction. So if you want to take a nice car off-roading, definitely throw some off-road tires on it. Uh, yo, uh, my, my, my goodness. You guys are killing me. You're, you're actually killing me. We got another $2 from Quentin 7 Lane. It says best video. Thank you, Quentin. I appreciate it a lot, man. And also Timothy Wolf. Two ninety nine. Thank you, Timothy. Thank you guys so much for the donos. It's so appreciated. So appreciated. Man, I want to read more chat, guys, but I do want to keep the stream on track so that when people watch this at a later date, they're not like, come on, man, get to the point. Make the tires bigger. Um, all right, so let's make these a little bigger now. So we go down to the tire menu, and what we want to do here is we want to make this wheel size, let me see, just a little bigger. So as you see, we're going to start making them bigger, but they're going to go down into the ground. Well, we're actually in mud, so they're not as in the ground as they look. There we go. Now that we're out of the mud, you can see they're only phasing into the ground a little bit. But to be honest, I want to make these a little bit bigger still. And we can also raise this car a little more so that the uh, body won't be phasing into the tires like that. Um, so, let's see. This looks a little bit funny with these tires this thin, doesn't it? Looks extra funny if we say, do this. Let's give it some, uh... <laughs> Here we got the bicycle tires on it. Yo, Gucci Boy Z, thank you for following me over on Twitch. Mo, what is up? Welcome to the stream. Uh, yes, I do have a Discord. If anybody wants to link my Discord in the chat, feel free to do so. I'm not able to at the moment. Uh, check this out, though. <laughs> This is basically what this thing would look like if it had bicycle tires. Pretty, uh... I don't know. I was gonna say pretty cool, but it's kind of not so cool. On the other hand, we could take it the other direction and do something, uh... you know. Super, super crazy. We could do something completely absurd. You know, I gotta say, this looks a little bit cooler. But, I don't know, it's not really too realistic, is it? Then again, there's nothing realistic about a lifted $3 million supercar. This whole stream is unrealistic, so who actually cares? So, maybe... Hold on, let me let me just see how this looks here for a second as we tear it through here. Guys, you're, you're killing me over here with the donos. I don't even know what to say, man. Quentin Seven Lane, another $2. He didn't even say anything this time, he's just making it rain. He's just sprinkling it in here. Thank you, Quentin. Loza says, don't skip leg day. Man, I gotta be honest. Anytime I got into lifting, which, you know, you can probably tell from looking at me, I never really stuck with lifting. I would do it for a few months at a time, then I'd lose steam. Kind of like me with YouTube, you know? It's, it's a weird thing. Uh, but leg day is always the hardest day to get motivated for. Those aren't like the show muscles, you know? The show muscles are like your arms and all that, but, you know, you gotta have the discipline to throw a leg day in there. Uh... All right, so let's take these tires down to a more realistic width. Something kind of like a monster truck-ish tire. Hmm, I kind of like something around there. Uh, but we're still going to be making these tires, I think, a little bigger. we got to get this vehicle lifted up a little higher first. So, let's see. Let's get off uh, out of the mud. Um, yo, thank you for uh, linking my Discord. The B Gamer BB has linked the Discord. If you want to click on it and uh, go over there, feel free to check it out. Um, so let's see here. So we can raise the, uh, the the what do you call it? The body. The body? Is this the body? Yeah, that's the body. Uh, <laughs> you can raise that up a little bit more, and this is going to give us some space to make the tires even a little bit bigger. So let's go back to tire size now. And. Uh, Oh my gosh, this is starting to get a little bit absurd, guys. Is this is this officially getting crazy? <laughs> I don't know. This 
I feel like this should be illegal. I feel like we're doing something wrong here. So there is something we can do to get these tires out of the ground a little bit. Uh, but we can't do too much because I've noticed that it'll start bugging out if we do too much of it. But let me show you. Uh, if we go to, I think, what is it? Tire menu, front, and I think I wrote it down, tire radius. I didn't want to be forgetting all this stuff, and I'm kind of rusty with this mod, so I took a few notes on exactly how to do all this. So we can lift the tires up to about, I think, here or here before they want to start bugging out. Yo, Gitchy1235. See, it's already bugging out a little bit. Let's try 0.47. If it starts getting too buggy, we can uh, take it down a few notches. But this way, it's not so phased into the ground. For the most part, it's not too noticeable. Maybe even 0.46. I see a little bit of bugginess in it. That seems better. Alright, let's do the same to the rear. Uh, tire radius. Bring it up a little bit so it's not phased in with the ground so much. And, okay. Alright, so for now, should we roll with this? <laughs> I gotta be honest, this looks pretty sweet. I'm gonna switch over to the controller right now. I've been using the mouse and keyboard so that I can, uh, you know, do these mods, but we're gonna switch over to the trusty Xbox controller. Yo, Jason, welcome to the stream. You're a big fan. I appreciate it, dude. Quentin with yet another, another super chat. I, you guys are getting me speechless here. Dollar Super Chat. Quentin, thank you so much, man. Between all you guys, you pretty much bought me lunch for, like, the next week. I don't even know what to say. You guys are amazing. Truly, like, words do not... Whatever. Words can't explain my thanks. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna have to end this stream if you guys keep doing this. Timothy Wolf. Timothy. Timothy put in this uh, nice little moving emoji thingy. You are amazing. $20 super chat. Y you guys are starting to pay my rent right now. I'm going to need you to stop. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Who? Wow. Wowee. Okay. Hey, Loza, are you the one on Twitch that gifted me that subscription? Yes, Loza is the one who uh, gifted the sub. Loza's a, a super generous guy from everything that I can see. DBDBDG here, here, here. <laughs> Thank you for following me over on Twitch, my man. All right, guys. So uh, let's do a little bit of testing with this thing officially. We're going to start driving up the river. Uh, but don't go yet because before we end the stream, in fact, in a little bit, not too long here, we're gonna really max it out. We can still put the uh, the body of the vehicle even higher, which means that we can make the tires even bigger. We're basically gonna make this thing as absurd as possible, as unrealistic as possible. We're just gonna just go all out with it. I gotta be honest, I think this thing looks completely sick. What do you guys think here in the chat? Yo, Quentin, you said you gotta go, man. You just came in here, you made it rain, and now you're humbly leaving. Like, okay, gotta go. Quentin, have a great day, my man. You... <laughs> Thank you. I don't know what else to say, man. Enjoy the rest of your day. Be safe. Wash your hands. Stay healthy. We're getting the worst views right now from the cinematic camera. I just want some nice cinematic shots. Is that too much to ask? Is that too much to ask? I always say the GTA uh, GTA 6 needs to have a better cinematic camera, I feel. Let's see, can we cross the river here? I don't know how deep this gets. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, I'm from Discord. I'm Brody. We talked. Yo, Brody, what is up, man? Yeah, I saw your messages today. Awesome to have you back, dude. Thanks for clicking on. Appreciate it. I want to play some spin tires with you. It would be fun. Yeah, so uh, I've been getting a lot of people saying they want to do some uh, some group spin tires. And to be honest, I've played so much single-player spin tires that I'm ready for some multiplayer. I do like spin tires, but I gotta be honest, it gets a tiny bit, um, it's just, I guess, repetitive playing alone every time. So I do want to start playing with more of you guys and get some good off-road, uh, group off-roading sessions. 
This thing feels basically just like, like an RC truck. It shouldn't even exist. It just doesn't even look real. By the way, the interior on this thing, super cool. I don't know how closely they modeled it to real life. I assume they did it pretty darn close. You know, what's the point in making a mod this nice if you're not going to model the interior accurately? It even has the rev meters there, as you can see. Shows you your speed, your RPMs. That would uh, kind of let you know when to shift in real life. I think that's a pretty nice feature. At this point, this thing's getting so big, I wish we could zoom it out a little bit, but this is the most we can actually zoom out. Can you bring back the four-wheeler videos? So many people have been asking for that, and that is part of the plan. I think I have so many videos that I want to make, so many games that I want to play, between, you know, six, seven different games. The RC videos, people want vlogs, they want four-wheeler videos. I have, like, so many ideas that it might take me a while to get around to all of them. Ooh, but the plan, that was pretty sweet. Oh my gosh, oh, oh, not like this, not like this. Okay, okay. I just do not want to flood this thing. Ooh, ooh, okay. If we flood the engine, I don't know if we're going to be able to fix it and repair it. It might require a full uh, remodding of this. For this section, I think we're going to go... Oof, I think we almost flooded it there. We're going to go up and around. Because, say we do flood the engine, I do not want to spend 15 minutes redoing all the stuff you just saw me do. Uh, can we talk later? Potentially. I've, uh, I've got a few things to do after this. I'm not going to have time for a Twitch stream today after this, so... Is Ohio pretty? There are definitely pretty places uh, in Ohio. Definitely nice, you know, nature parts of it. Uh, pom pom, pam pom, or whatever that was. Thank you for the follow on Twitch, my man, or my girl. I do appreciate it a lot. Isn't there a little, uh, a little thingy that lets off this way? A little thing, thingy majig? Ah, this is kind of lame. Ooh, that's a nice shot, though. I like that. I like turtles. One, two, three, four, five, six. Thank you for dropping that follow. I did not think we'd be getting this many followers on Twitch here today. Um, I appreciate that a lot. I do love the Twitch streams. I love streaming on Twitch. Uh, it's a lot easier to interact with all you guys because the chat isn't so lit. And uh, also just getting to play some different games and just kind of do whatever I want. Sometimes we also just browse memes. Sometimes I'll be streaming on Twitch and we'll just watch some YouTube videos and uh, you know exchange funny videos Say what we think, you know? It's a, a fun time. Try not to be seen outside or you'll be fined 500 bucks. <laughs> Thankfully, that is not the case. I was worried that that was the case when they said that there was a stay-at-home order. But uh, from what I understand, they're not really enforcing it. Because even if you're out and about, you could be going to your grandmother's house. Well, let's not say grandmother's. You could be going to your dad or mom's house uh, to, you know, drop off some groceries or something like that. So... It's not like the roads have to be empty, but, uh, yeah. There's basically, there's nowhere to really go right now anyway. Like, it doesn't matter if there's a stay-at-home order, because everything's closed. Want to go to the bowling alley? Nope. Closed. Want to go see a movie? Nope. Closed. You want to go, uh, play some miniature golf? Nope. Pretty sure that's closed. The one thing you can still do is disc golf, because you do that outside at the park, and I think they said that outside activities are still allowed. Alright, so I'm thinking what we're gonna do here... Let me see, how deep is this? I hope... Ooh. Oh! So one funny thing about this, you can tell that this car is not made for off-roading. It basically has super, super stiff suspension. So instead of the tire kind of pushing in and absorbing the impact, you get a lot of, uh, a lot of, like, shaky choppiness because there's no suspension travel. There's pretty much zero suspension travel. So when we do hit a rock, the entire vehicle just kind of jars upward. So if you're wondering why it looks like that, that's the reason why. It's pretty got, pretty much got no suspension. Again, that's one of those mods that I hope they add for GTA 6. I hope we get a lot more off-road upgrades, but for now, we gotta go with this. 
But you know what? I'm not really complaining. You know, mods allow us to have crazy control already over what we do. Alright guys, so question in the chat here. Should we lift this thing higher right now? Or should we, like, drive up Mount Chiliad first and then lift it higher? What should we do? Let's see how we interact with cars real quick. I'm curious. Where is all the traffic? There's somebody. He's in a truck, so that's not very small. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so we are basically... Ooh, are we going to be able to roll over? Okay. I was afraid we were going to be stuck in a cycle of, like, rolling back and forth and not being able to get back up on our, our wheels here. Alright, let's uh, take this guy on here. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. Okay. Alright. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. okay, no, no, no. This is not what we want. This, okay. Oh, boy. All right. Lift it higher. Lift it higher. Yes, yes. Run a car over. Y'all are lucky. Y'all can stay home. I'm going to be on tr patrol tomorrow giving people tickets for going outdoors. Oh, yeah. Your name is West Virginia State Police. Well, man. Good luck with that. That's uh, That should be an interesting day for you. Yo, Loza. With another super chat. How do you mention forgot what do you mean mention like mention in chat like at gitchy1230 is that kind of what you mean like spike please all right let's do one like spike and then we're going to lift it pretty much as high as we can uh, and see what happens all right so let's do it we're gonna go uh three two one like spike. I hope all these uh, these nice effects are working. I'm trying to really uh, upgrade your guys' viewing experience. Hopefully, it's all coming through. Tell me if you drop a like down below. I'm gonna be shouting out a few of you guys who do. And then as soon as we get this like spike out of the way, we are going to pretty much max this thing out in terms of. Uh, you know, tire size, lift height, all that good stuff. I believe you can only mention someone on PC. Isaac, you might be right about that. <laughs> That's a sick cop watching somebody play a crime game. <laughs> it is kind of funny. But hey, even police officers can have their fun with Grand Theft Auto, right? Ooh, that's like borderline inappropriate right there. That's like... Oh, you do not want to fight me, man. You do not want to fight this. You're telling me you see this car on the road and you want to fight the man driving it? I'm not even going to bother with that guy. In fact, actually, you know what? Maybe I will bother with him. Ugh, he got away. Yo, so guys, B, Dunn, David, thank you guys for the likes. High center of gravity is high. Or center of gravity is high. Oh, yes, very high. Uh, Brody, a.k.a. AK Mercedes. Whoa, hold on, wait, this guy is back with a vengeance. What did he just do? He just drove himself off into the water. <laughs> what? Oh, I don't want to miss this leg spike. Uh, Hellcat, Ben, Amanda, uh, Wayne, uh, Sebastian, Alex, KTLB, welcome back, KT. Good to have you here. Timothy Wolf, thank you for dropping the like. Landon Coleman, Crystal Ramirez. WTF is a like. I always leave a dislike. Oh, Isaac, how could you? Stone Cold. Stone Cold, man. Stone Cold. Uh, let me see. Douglas Nelson, thank you for dropping the like. Amanda, I think I already said Amanda. Uh, Hunter Hovers. Hovers? Thank you for dropping the like, man. I do appreciate it. If you guys ever wonder why people ask for likes, it just helps the video do better. And of course, I do want people to see my content. I want to grow this whole group that we have here and bring in more people. So if you uh, if you enjoy the content and you want to see it grow, that's where likes come in and they help. We got our boy Loza again here. <laughs> Two dollar super chat. Shout out to Crystal Ramirez and your mini me. 
Oh wait, your mini me. What is that about? I did see Crystal in chat, but I know nothing about the mini me. Give me a small vehicle so we can kind of just run it over again. All right. Ramped into the water like a boss. You got that right. Uh, good to be here. Yo, KT. It is good to have you here. Douglas Nelson, thank you for the like. Landon, appreciate the kind words, dude. Alright, let's, uh... I guess let's lift this thing the rest of the way, huh? Do you get money for likes? No. I get zero pennies, nothing at all for a like. They do not give me anything financially. Uh, the only thing that does give money on YouTube is views, um, super chats, obviously, but like subscriptions, likes, nope. Those are all just for helping try to grow the content, grow the channel, and that kind of stuff. Um, how expensive is that car in real life? Yeah, wait, so let me repeat this since um, I said it at the beginning, but I know we have a lot of new people here. So, last thing before we lift this thing up a little bit higher. Here are the specs of this vehicle. I wrote these down so I wouldn't forget. So, this is a $3 million car about. Has a top speed of 278 miles per hour. Some people say 300, over 300, but I took the conservative side of that. You got a 0 to 60 speed, uh, or 0 to 60 time of 1.9 seconds. It is powered by, by a 5.0 liter twin turbocharged V8 engine, capable of putting out 1,281 horsepower. And it's got a 9-speed multi-clutch transmission. 9-speed. Nine 9-speed. Nine like, what? Yeah, this thing is not to be messed with. Yo, Melindu, welcome back. Glad to have you here. I'm doing pretty good here today. All right. I keep, uh, I keep saying I'm going to do it, guys. It's time to do it. All right, let's go back into this mod menu here. Am I going to stream tomorrow? I definitely plan to stream tomorrow, but, uh, you know, as always, there's like a 10% chance that something weird will come up and I won't, but definitely trying to stream Monday through Friday. Alright, so, we want to go, what is it, suspension menu? And so how high can we make the body? Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Hold on, hold on. Wait a second. Ooh, it's getting a little buggy on us, I think. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like that. It looks kinda goofy. It's like a super go-kart type, dune buggy type, supercar type, what do you call the Batmobile, the, uh, the, the tumbler is it? I'm thinking of the one Batmobile that looks a bit like this. I think it's the tumbler. I don't watch a lot of Batman. I haven't seen a lot of the movies. Oh, I kind of love this. Can you do some more Spin Tires Mudrunner videos? Yes, for sure. More Spin Tires coming, more Beam NG. Why don't you stream more often? Well, the plan is to start streaming more often. Um, I just, I don't know. Sometimes I just, I disappear for a little while, and then I come back. This time, I'm not planning to disappear. But then again, I wasn't planning to disappear the other times either. But, uh, no, I want to be here. I, uh... I feel a lot better when I'm in the whole groove of YouTubing and getting to chat with you guys. It's a lot of fun, and uh, I don't know. For me, it's fulfilling. I really enjoy it. Alright, so uh, maybe, though... <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me see something. How low can we put this thing? I think we could put it a little lower, and then we can take it to the highest side. Um... Okay, so that is officially the lowest it can be. Looks a little weird with the tires phased into it. We could spread the wheelbase out a little bit, but I'm not going to bother, because the point of this stream isn't really... Well, actually, you know what? We could do it. We could do it. I want to see how it looks. Eh, I don't want to be coasting backwards, though. I just sent 40 cents to your PayPal. Yo, Isaac. Isaac, thank you for pretty much a super chat. I appreciate it, man. 40 cents to the PayPal. Every little bit helps. Too much tire clipping. Yeah, let's fix the tire clipping real quick, just to see what it looks like. Uh, tons of tire clipping. Alright, 
so let's see rear track width is this too much tire clipping okay that's actually kind of nifty not gonna lie that's kind of crazy kind of sweet doesn't work very well it wants to like bug out a little bit but uh we kind of got like one of those uh what do you call the three wheel things two in the front one in the back oh boy okay this could get ugly uh, okay i was gonna say we cannot afford to have this thing explode on us we've come way too far we've come way too far to have this blow up now hey, look out for fools like me. sorry lady I, I, i'm really sorry Yo, Robert, welcome to the stream, dude. You've grown since 10k, jeez. Yeah, we're a little uh, better off than 10k now. We gotta re-hit 500k, that's the goal here. Okay, so... That looks a little better, huh? What is tire clipping? Um, so clipping is a thing, as far as I understand, in, like, video games and, uh, 3D graphics when one object is, like, phasing through the other. Like, one item is passing through another... One object is passing through another object, basically. They call it clipping, I've heard it called phasing, um, but I think clipping is the most common term used for it. Konaseg motorcycle? We could try a motorcycle here. Remind me later in the stream. Yeah, the slingshot. Thank you guys. That is what I'm thinking of. Occasionally we'll uh, we'll see slingshots around here. Do I have a snap? I do. I think my snapchat's just gitchy1230. Pretty sure. I haven't been using it lately. I've been doing a lot more uh, Instagram. Okay. Uh, actually, let's go to the top of the mountain. Then at the top of the mountain, we'll make it a little bit... Uh... Ooh, this is getting a little tight. Then, at the top, we'll go for the full-on maximum height lift. That looks cool, not gonna lie. Dude, I gotta agree. I gotta agree with you there. It looks pretty sick. Alright, almost getting up there to the top. Ugh. Oh, don't go off the side. Do not. I swear, if I were to go off the side and blow up right now... I'd have a... I'd punch a hole through my monitor, most likely. Oh, I just looked over at chat and almost just drove off the side. Oh, jeez. Yo, Shane-ism, 1G. Welcome to another stream, Shane. You're another name that I've seen in countless streams. Welcome back, dude. Glad to have you here. Try the biggest tires and the smallest lift so it can drive upside down. That would be awesome. Unfortunately, I don't think that would work. I could be wrong, and it's worth testing. That would be super cool if it could drive upside down and right side up. I don't think it would work, but it's definitely worth a try. Gitchy, why did you make your name Gitchy1230? Oof, that's a classic question. Vex Hunter is mad at you for not doing Minecraft. I told her we'll do some Minecraft here, uh, maybe this week. It would be a fun, easy stream to do. It would be real casual, and I think you guys would enjoy it as well. What mod is this? Um, this is the Konaseg uh, Jesko with the suspension mod, aka lifting mod. Um, just followed you on Insta, my dude. Yo, Shane, I appreciate it, man. Hey. Okay, what is going on? I had like a fence stuck under me or something. That fence does not like to interact with this vehicle. All right, we are almost to the top where we are officially gonna max it out. I think once we give it maximum lift, the tires are gonna be going into the ground a little bit, but that's just a limitation of the mod. It should still look pretty sick. All right, all right, here we go. Uh, why did I make my name Gitchy1230? I've told this story so many times. I'll give a quick version of it. When I was making my first gamer tag, I didn't have an Xbox yet. My friend was making it for me. I think I went upstairs from the basement to, like, get a glass of water or something. So what do you want your name to be? I said, uh, make it Gutchy. Because I thought Gutchy was a funny word when I was 
uh, you know, like 12, 13. Your gutchies are like your underwear or whatnot. I came back. He was like, okay, I'm done. And I look at it and he added one, two, three on his own, but he forgot the letter U. And I'm, I'm like, dude, you forgot the U. He's like, what? I'm like, look, there's no U. That says Gitchy. And from there it all just stuck. It, uh, it became just my, my identity. It's kind of a funny thing, right? All right, so here we go, boys. Watch it grow. Watch it get taller. We, we getting up there, up towards the clouds. Uh, yeah, Instagram. Actually, Instagram is at gitchy1230yt. If you guys, real quick while I do this, um, follow on Instagram. If you guys want to, I'm going to read out Instagram followers in like 10 minutes. So if you guys want a quick shout out, follow me on Instagram. And I'll be shouting out everybody who follows within the next 10 or so minutes. Imagine if it was Gutchy1230 instead. I know, right? Like, it just sounds so weird now. Can you make part two of the Hulk mod? I'm glad you liked part one. Um, a lot of people have been requesting... Uh, more mods like Superman mod, Iron Man mod, you suggested Hulk mod. Maybe I should do that. Maybe I should do that. Alright. Wheel size. Let's see if this even looks right. This is, uh. How big can we actually make them? What the heck? So, we can get super crazy with it if we want. Oh no. That might be too far. Is that is that too far? Is this still realistic? Is this real life? I don't know, guys. This seems uh not too bad. Okay, that might be a little too big, huh? We at least gotta have the tires so that they're not touching into each other. <laughs> I don't know, I think this is pretty realistic. I saw a car exactly like this in real life one time. Will you be playing SnowRunner when it comes out on April 28th? That is a big, fat yes. When am I gonna play MudRunner? Not sure of the exact day yet, but it's gonna be soon. So the biggest we can make the tires without them rubbing is pretty much right in there let me see wow um, so let's make them a little wider because there that looks I think better maybe <laughs> this is absurd what is actually happening right now the let's go front track width Bring it in just a little bit. We got a little bit of clipping, but it's not so much clipping that it destroys the immersion, I don't think. And then the back, what do we have in the back with? One point, let's make a match, 1.51. One. Uh, yo guys, thanks for the follows on Instagram. I'll be checking those in a few minutes here and shout all you guys out. Who's the other Gitchy on Instagram? Um, it kind of sucks, but that dude beat me to my own name. He stole my name. He pretended to be me. I messaged Instagram to try to get my name back because it's essentially like identity theft <laughs> to some degree. And Instagram was no help. They didn't help me get the actual name. So I had to add YT, which stands for YouTube. Um, so yeah. And, and the worst part is the guy, last time I checked, he was using terrible grammar on his account. Look at that. Oh my goodness. That is... There's something wrong with this. This is not right. This is not right. Uh, I want to drive this thing off a mountain, but there's there's too much risk in exploding. Because, you know, once we explode, we're back at square one. And as, as I keep saying, we've come too far to go back to square one at this point. Can you put your snap there, too? Um, I think... I'm not, I can't do that right now. I could, but I would have to pause the gameplay and everything for a minute. I think my snap is either... I think it's Gitchy1230. If it's not Gitchy1230, then it's Gitchy1230YT. No, it's, it's just plain old Gitchy1230. Yeah, isn't that a shame that it's a fake account? 
and the dude has terrible grammar, makes me look stupid. I hate it. Gitchy, I'm gonna head off to bed. Gotta get ready to go to work tomorrow. Yo, West Virginia State Police. Enjoy your day tomorrow, man. Keep people safe out there. Make sure that they're not going out and about just for the fun of it. Make sure they're, uh, you know, only going out for groceries. Maybe, uh, hand sanitizer. Stuff like that. Yo, Elite. Thank you, dude. I'm gonna try to keep up the good work. I'm doing my best out here. Now jump it off the steep side. Maybe at the end of the stream. Ooh, this actually gets... This gets a little sketchy here. Yo, guys, I gotta say it. We got... Loza. With another... Super chat. Staying by for one mil subs. Uh, Gitchy and I are doing a meet. Dude, I, I can't wait. So, yeah, sounds like the plan is if I ever hit a million subs. Not if I ever hit. When I hit a million subs, uh... Loza and I might go out to the West Coast and I don't know we, we talked about what renting supercars for a day and just uh, Celebrating That could be pretty tight You can probably drive it upside down like that. Uh, we got to try that we got to try it. I'm wondering if the wheels would phase through or if it would actually work Remind me to do that before the stream ends uh, Let's get back down to the bottom of the mountain I'm still laughing just at how ridiculous this looks. When I get my money, I'll donate 40 bucks. Eh, whatever you want to do, man. I always say no need to donate. If it feels natural and you truly want to do it, then do it. But I never ask for donations, you know? I do ask for likes, though. I do ask for likes. So drop a like. Drop a like down below. Hit that like button. Assault that like button. I probably shouldn't encourage assaulting a like button, should I? Nah. Probably a bad idea. Timothy Wolf. Timothy Wolf. Making it rain. Once again, with another super chat. chat. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Holy. Thank you, dude. How do you speak like that? Oh, I got a few tricks. I, uh, I took voice lessons for a little bit, and they teach you how to speak really, really low. Like, super low. And once I learned how to do it, I was just like... I was just like... You know, I'm just like... Wow! Wowee! And, uh, you know, that, that was pretty much that. You're great and deserve the love, man. I appreciate that, Elite. Still have that $500 donation on my mind. Please no. Please no. That is officially uncomfortable that's like that's like an awkward donation i don't know unless i knew it was coming from like elon musk i'd be like okay elon yeah go ahead and don't donate me 500 bucks but uh oh i don't want any of you guys giving me 500 of your hard-earned dollars at, at that point i'd like legit almost start feeling like i guess guilty even though i shouldn't feel guilty for it but something about it would feel weird all right we got a small jump here <gasps> Okay. Alright. Uh, are voice settings back on normal? Yes, they are. Okay. Can you do a like spike? We actually just did a like spike recently, but we can do another one soon here. Alright, so we gotta try rolling this thing and seeing if it'll allow us to... Maybe drive upside down? Are you ever going to change your YouTube profile picture? Maybe one day if I do some kind of rebranding. At the moment, it's kind of like my logo, I guess. So maybe if I ever do an updated logo. Ooh, there's a shootout going on. Let's find the shootout. Maybe we can help. Oh, we got three hillbillies versus two cops. What's going to happen? The hillbillies are looking good. They're looking strong. We have one police officer down. Oh, okay, the one hillbilly is leaving his other two hillbilly friends. The one chases after him. Oh my gosh. The cop's still going for shots on that hillbilly. One hillbilly's dead in the road. We got a dead cop in the road. The cop is pursuing. I don't know if he's going to catch up. He's going to have to run a little bit faster than that if he wants to catch this guy. Looks like the head hillbilly in charge is getting away. Oh my lord. 
Yo, you got a million dollar donation on your mind? Please. Go right ahead. I assaulted your like button. Yo, thanks, man. Look, he's getting back in! He's getting back in the original truck! Alright, I guess not. This thing is crazy. It's too bad that our wheels phase into the ground as much as they do. I can try to lift them up a little bit, but I think they're going to start bugging really bad. Oh yeah, um, let's read the Instagram followers real quick. Then after I read Instagram followers, uh, those of you who just followed in the last few minutes, uh, we're going to see if we can raise these tires up out of the ground a little bit without them bugging and glitching out. Um, that would be pretty nice. That would be pretty nice, because this looks great, but it kind of does bother me that they got to be that far into the ground. You should do a video and do a video chat with your fans. That's kind of a, a not a bad idea. That would be cool to actually talk with you guys in real time and make a video of that. Alright. Okay. I don't need a new four-wheeler. This Polaris 800... Uh, lifted is pretty sweet you gave me 40 bucks before Atlanta and I dude I appreciate each donation so much man they are not forgotten all right so let's see here back to the suspension menu um, what do we go to again I think it's tires front and I think is you can see here we're at 40.46 I think once we hit like 0.47 0.48 yeah, see how already the front tires are starting to, like... Whoa, 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 whoa. Starting to spaz a little bit. So if I were to take it all the way out of the ground... Say we wanted to do something like this. That would look amazing. But pretty sure the tire is going to start spazzing really badly the second I move. Uh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, alright, alright. Let's not glitch out here. Uh. Uh, uh. What did we have it at? 0.48. Yeah, so even here at 0.53 bugging out it is not happy but once we bring it back down to its happy place right around this area it works fine so unfortunately we just have to accept that the wheels do phase into the ground it's not super noticeable when you're just driving normally all right let's uh shout out those of you who just followed on insta let me see here instagrams Let me see here. Oh, we got 10 new followers, it looks like. <laughs> All right, so uh, followers from today include... Um, we got Burks Brendan started following. Sandaroo772, thank you. Hellcat4200, thank you, Hellcat. I saw you in chat here a lot. Uh, Nova NovaNVYT, thank you for following. Douglas Nelson 2447 B Harris 289 uh, Douglas you also like my video thank you Gitchy the best youtuber in the world thank you for the follow on Instagram uh, Kevin Re Remen thank you for dropping the follow Evan Meeker thank you for the follow and the last one Isaac Matthews photography thank you for the follow <laughs> Isaac I get the feeling that you unfollowed and refollowed just to be on that list you know what? I don't blame you. That's actually not a bad idea. No, but uh, hopefully, yeah. Hopefully we don't start a trend of that, because uh, that would be a pain in the butt. If people start unfollowing and refollowing just to get a shout-out, I'm going to have to do something about it. Um, maybe, I don't know. Well, we'll come to that when it's actually a problem. Um, all right, so to wrap this all up, since we're starting to near somewhat of the end here um how close are we kind of want to get this thing back to the swamp area one more time 
just to uh, give it its final hurrah, you know? They should put a Tesla in GTA 6, that'd be super cool. I agree, they do have the one electric car in GTA 5, what is it? It's called the, um, the Coil, which is a reference to Tesla, because you might have heard of a Tesla coil before. That's, uh, that was invented by Nikola Tesla, and it was, it was a thing that would arc electricity off and around it. He's often known as, like, the father of electricity, but Thomas Edison gets a lot of the praise for it. Even though Thomas Edison basically stole Tesla's ideas, Edison had a lot more money to work with, so he was able to take those ideas and put, you know, 100 engineers working on these things to figure out how to do it best. And so Edison got a lot of the credit, even though Tesla was the one discovering a lot of the initial things. It's kind of weird. It's too bad for Tesla. He didn't get the recognition at the time that he deserved. At least nowadays, he's got a, uh, you know, a, uh, ooh. A right he didn't make it, did he? I'm gonna say that's a, a big old fat no. Um, first time pronounced right, last name pronounced as Raymond. Okay, cool. Never seen Raymond pronounced, or, uh, spelled that way. I don't know anybody with that last name. Thanks for letting me know, though. I unfollowed and refollowed. Please no one do what I do. Leave it to me. <laughs> Yo, Ca Capri Sun, welcome. I haven't had a Capri Sun in... I think it's been, like, legit years. I kind of miss Capri Suns, I gotta say. All right, we're driving back to the swampy area here for one final hurrah in the mud, in the water. And this time, if we flood the engine, it doesn't really matter because guess what? It doesn't matter, you know? The stream will be over at that point, so we can really abuse this thing. Whoa, his tires are almost bigger than mine. You know, I gotta say it once again. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, oh, one shot and I'm dead. Why? Why? Oh, no. Oh. Dude had a gun on him. Dude actually had a gun. Wrecked by a farmer. Oh man, that's, that's so bad. bad. Oh. Who's Tic Tac PP Jones? I don't know. That's that one guy that Jay knows who would play Rocket League with us on occasion, but I haven't talked to him in a while. Oh my gosh. Okay, so. If it makes you guys feel any better about the upside down driving, yo, Strong Gnome 4547. First off, that's a great name. Uh, thank you for the follow over on Twitch. Yeah, I should have had invincibility on. Um, yo, Unstable Asylum, what is up? So, if it makes you guys feel any better, uh, there's pretty good odds that. Uh, not in vehicle or no saved vehicle. Hey, I think our game just crashed. I think that might be it. You guys heard the sound. Pretty sure this thing decided that uh, it's time for us to be done. Really? At least show me Grand Theft Auto V is not responding. Here, let me read some chat here in the meantime. Um, I'm not actually serious. I don't remember. I don't know if I saw what you were talking about. Oh, okay. Who's Tic Tac PP Jones? Yeah, I thought you were serious. <laughs> uh, should I should play 5M. I have played 5M, and it is a lot of fun. Uh, I do like it. Um, I wish I had some friends to play with. Get you 1230 merch coming soon. Loza, my man. You you are just making it rain out here. You're, you're just out here like this. You're just... 
Thank you for the additional $2 super chat. There we go. The game officially crashed. What did it say there? Uh, Grand Theft Auto V exited unexpectedly. Please click retry below to enter the game again. Or click safe mode to launch the game with reduced graphics settings. If you continue to have problems playing the game, please contact Rockstar Game Customer Service. Wow. Rip to Savage Jason. I forgot about that. That dude was legendary. Didn't he donate like 200 bucks or something one time? I can't remember. Oh my goodness. Um, Mudrunner multiplayer time. No, no, no. I, I really can't. I have things I gotta do after this. Uh, you know. Um, yo, Jeffrey, welcome to the stream. Unstable Asylum, you're my favorite streamer, dude. Unstable. Thank you. I appreciate that a lot, man. I, I always feel bad when people say I'm their favorite streamer, and then I think about how I like would disappear um, for months at a time. And it's like, oh, why do I do this? Like, people rely on me. I'm, I'm some people's favorite streamer, and then I leave them hanging and disappear. Ugh. Hopefully the days of disappearing are over. But as I always say, I've kind of learned not to make promises to you guys that I can't fulfill. Because then that's just, that's just crappy. That's, that's not a good way to be. All right, well, for the heck of it, I'll, I'll start loading back into the game. I was planning on streaming... Um, for about 12 more minutes rip to soap dropper oh my gosh soap dropper was legendary man he was legendary landon enjoy uh, your basketball dude i miss playing basketball i really do there's a gymnasium across the street from me with a, a basketball court and you can pay to rent it and i always think to myself okay if we got 10 people we could do five on five basketball split the cost and it wouldn't be too expensive um, GTA multiplayer there's not even enough time to really do anything in multiplayer since I gotta end so soon is that voice memos you're using um, I'm using a voice transformer a uh, Roland voice transformer I can show it on stream here this guy right here so uh, we can do some nifty things with it we can do a little bit of do a little, a little bit, bit of this you know that's not too bad we can do a little bit of that we could uh you know we could do anything we want to do here really it's not too bad is it? all right let me get out of this house before i get a copyright strike for music blah 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 blah, blah. i don't want it to identify this music copyright strikes are real on youtube all it's got to do is pick up a little bit of a song and boom, your video demonetized. I thought he's pulling this dude over. Hmm. Don't get all hysterical, hon. Joke's on you. I'm going to his house to show up on stream right now. Oh boy. I don't think my door is locked right now. Should I go lock my doors? Should I actually go do that right now? You guys want to know what another good stream might be? Real quick, let's see, just to wrap up the stream here. I want to see something. Check this out. Say we wanted to lift one of these. I want to see something. So if we go to our mod menu, suspension menu, front height. So we got to drive while we lift it. Okay, okay, all right, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. All right, all right, all right, okay, okay, not looking too bad. Yo, we got Joe in the chat, what up Joe? 
Welcome, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Joe with, uh... In this one friend Discord I'm in, friends have permission to change people's names. So, uh, they made sure to give me a really creative name. Um, let's see here. Let's make this track width a little bit wider. Joe, you missed it. We, uh, we were driving this lifted supercar, man. It was sick. And then I rammed into this farmer's tractor, and he pulled a gun on me, and I tried to get away, and somehow he, like, sniped me through this car. Killed me. It's just too time-consuming to do it all again. Yo, look at this thing. The ability to pop wheelies. Who would have thought this thing has so much power? Oh, boy. Center of gravity is a little bit high. Center of gravity is a little bit high. I've been watching you since 90,000 subs. Honey Badger, that's a pretty long time, dude. That's got to be at least a few years. Thanks for hanging in there with me. All right, so let me see here. Let's say we wanted to uh, put some off-road tires on this thing. Um, vehicle mod menu. Off-road tires. Now let's actually see the tires. All right, any of these will do, really. Let's go back to here. Tires. Wheel size. Okay, all right. Let's make them a little bit wider. Um, they're gonna have to be a little bigger. Maybe we overlifted the the smart car. You've known me since I was crazy Cajun. Oh, dude. I'm gonna be completely honest. I knew your profile picture looked familiar. It's like the Fleur de Lis or whatever they call it, the Saint symbol. But I, I kind of forgot for a second that you are crazy Cajun. That's the one bad thing about when people change their names. Sometimes I'm like, I'm so in the habit of calling them the same thing for years that I start to, uh, starts to slip my mind a little bit. Um, whoa, that truck is bugging out back there. Is the game gonna crash again? Okay. Uh, let me see. Let's try to raise these out of the ground a little bit. Uh, see, we went too far. You gotta find that perfect point where it's not bugging out. That looks pretty good. What is that? 0.34. Let's do that to the other one as well. 0.34. And actually, that's uh, that doesn't look too bad. There we go. There we go. Now that is a smart car. That right there is a smart car. That's too much get up and go. Can hardly drive it without popping a, an involuntary wheelie. Let me try being a little bit lighter on the throttle. Can you lift a plane? I don't think so. Like, for example, if you're on a motorcycle, it doesn't even allow you to open that mod menu. So this thing does not drive very well once it's lifted like this. It's got some issues. Panto basically has bicycle tires. Pretty much. Pretty much. Let's take it down here. Oh! Uh, yep, there's one way to get it down there. That's one way to do it. Um, what do we have in chat? Did I miss anything? Can you add a Diesel Brothers truck to the game? You might hate me, but to be honest, I don't know what Diesel Brothers is. Why is this thing freaking out now that it's in the water? What the heck? Oof. This thing is... Oh! Somehow we flooded its engine. Does fixed car actually fix it nowadays? It didn't used to fix it. Maybe, what if we get it out of the water first? Now, does fixing it do anything? Hey, there we go. Hmm, the only other way we could kind of pretend to drive it would be putting speed boost on. What is that, the 9 key? 
That way we can kind of drive it. Not too bad, right? <laughs> GTA 5 is now spin tires. When I'm playing it, yes. Get you got to go enjoy the rest of your day. Oh, go enjoy the rest of your day. Yeah, man, we'll be wrapping it up here in the next few minutes. So uh, I think the rest of my day should be pretty good. My old profile is named the real name. It was called Sam, if you remember, the name with a Minecraft profile picture, and that was me when I was 10. If it was only Sam and nothing else, Sam alone doesn't really ring a bell. But uh, I do appreciate you for being around for so long, man. Okay, an hour in the sun. Shirtless is where I'm going to call it. Wait, are you actually laying shirtless in the sun? Damn, I'm jealous, dude. It's like another cold day here in Ohio. It's going to blow up if I land, isn't it? Not if we put on Invincible. Now we won't blow up. Right into a telephone pole. Beautiful. Squat it. Ooh, this thing is so pathetic. This thing is actually so pathetic. Can you do a BeamNG live stream with the wheel? I would like to do that, yeah. I looked back at one of the wheel videos and I noticed that when I turn left, the wheel makes like a whining sound that I didn't really notice. And it's kind of unfortunate. When I turn right, it doesn't do it. So it's gonna be a little bit annoying for the videos, but what are you gonna do? It should, uh, it should work. People just gotta get over the whining sound, but it'll probably be a little, a little bit irritating for the videos. You should put tracks on trucks for GTA 6. I'd like to see that. Or they should. I agree. I think that would be a good option. I think we need a lot more off-road options. I don't know. They have so many street customizations, but like... I do think they'll wake up to the fact that people do like off-roading in GTA. The physics and all that are finally realistic enough to where it's actually fun to go off-roading. Back in the PS2 days... There weren't really mud physics there, you know, it was like all just jagged hard surface. So it was kind of hard to do any fun off-roading, but we're at the point where in these games, the, the physics engine is advanced enough to actually make really spongy suspensions and all that work and be pretty fun too. Will I be on Discord later? I'm not really sure. Um... I don't know exactly how my night's gonna go down. I got some stuff to do after this, and I don't know exactly how long. Whoa! <laughs> that was pretty crazy. That was a nice bounce. It's a panto. What did you expect? Uh, I'm, I'm not really sure what I expected. TBH. What? What is happening? What even is this? Can you do Throwback Thursdays? Hmm, what would I do for a Throwback Thursday? Maybe play some GTA 5? Just kidding. Obviously, that's what we're doing now. Yo, Vincent SK, welcome to the stream, dude. Forza Horizon 4, that's what you should play with the wheel. People keep telling me to play some Forza. Maybe I'll actually do that. I think it was on sale a bit ago, and I should have picked it up on sale. Can we get back to land, or is that pretty much impossible now? I think that might just be impossible at this point. Where are we? Where actually are we? Oh, there we are. <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, guys. So, we are going to uh, get into closing words here. Speak now or forever hold your peace. Uh, I planned out the stream wrapped up at 2.30, and it is 2.30 right now, so... Uh, I'm going to say, guys, thank you so much for all being here today. This was a really fun stream. Um, yeah, Joe, you were playing Forza Horizons uh, just recently, weren't you? Horizon 4? Let me see what that game costs, and I might just pick it up. Guys, please be sure to drop a like before you go. Please, please. Please, if you'd be so kind. It would mean a lot to me. It does help out. But uh, this was a fun stream. I enjoyed it a lot. Uh, I hope you guys did as well. Thank you guys all for clicking on. Thanks for dropping those likes. Thanks to those of you who followed on Instagram. Um, I'll be live tomorrow. Here's the thing. 
if for some reason I'm not on YouTube tomorrow, I will be on Twitch. So make sure you follow on Twitch and turn on mm. post notifications. We're about to drown. That's okay. Um, turn on notifications on Twitch, because otherwise you're not going to really know if I go live. So, uh, yeah. If I don't have time for YouTube, I'll do Twitch. Um, I don't know what game we'll play. Maybe Rocket League tomorrow? Um, but, yeah. Sweet. So thank you guys all so much for being here. I love you all. Uh, especially those of you who donated and super chatted. I can't believe how generous some of you guys are. Just making it rain in these streams. I appreciate the heck out of it. So I will talk to you guys later. Um, I'll probably be... If I get on Discord later, it'll probably be late-ish. Maybe like 9, 10, 11 o'clock my time. Midnight my time. I'm not really sure. I gotta see how my night unfolds. Uh, but on that note... Today I'm going to make sure I actually end the stream properly. Yesterday was kind of funny. I thought I was off stream and I'm just sitting here like chilling. Okay. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Have a great night. Be safe out there. Wash your hands often. Stay healthy. And don't touch your eyeballs. Peace. <laughs>